How's it going, everyone? So, in today's episode, we're seeing Ultra Blue Go Jita Bennett that just returned for Dragon Ball Legends. Now, we did know this is probably going to happen very soon because, yet again, this is a bait banner before I go too much into this video, before, like whether you should summon or skip. But if you do want to summon, no, going, I would probably recommend going, going this for one, one of these banners. banners the Gamma's banner, uh, Piccolo's if banner if as well, tell, like, we're gonna or you even if you want to go for Freezer. Slow the speed but, in the summons, but if it's just trash, I'll like, just speed it up. Gogeta Blue is actually still one of the best okay. units in the game. Anything? In fact, let's have a quick Vegeta look at his stats and that's still. Fusion. Okay, Fusion, Gold Um, I haven't nice. got him Soul Boosted. Yeah, usually no, Blue Vegeta is Blue Vegeta Blue Vegeta indicates LR and then Super Vegeta just gains the second first as well. 283k for Strike, 259, you know, Blast, Like He's definitely very good still. I'll take that. Like, he's still a very But yet again, though, even if we do get... But the biggest problem I have, I think at this point, if we have a good look at the banner as well, so is one you that, don't the rate you're gonna get him? So it I'll share the zero point three five zero. Yet again, not very high. Okay, if you compare it to LF. So it's so probably it LFs again. So twenty percent for a spark. It's not Super Saiyan Four Gogeta. I think literally everyone else beside you. Know, so you have more of a chance of pulling the gammas over Gogeta Blue, but who said? Oh, I don't need the. I guess the next thing is, would you? I can go. Are the gammas or people are better than? Gogeta Blue? So was like, I don't need Gogeta, that's okay. I don't know, maybe. Add another, it's okay, uh, 7% maybe. for him already. But, yeah, go let's have a quick the banner got, though before we go too much more. JP, so let's get Gogeta Blue, which I'm at now. Though, I'll take that, 3 Dokkan first one. Uh, go and Vegeta here, too much. they can be okay still, I haven't seen them used in a little while. Okay, Krill in there as well. But uh, I might do a Shaco sooner than actually. Because they probably still have one of the best LFs in the game still, I would say. But I don't know okay, why I'd Goku, actually no, rank him on a good. tier list. God Goku using indicates. And uh, what else? We got Broly as well, which as well. he actually could get a Zenkai this week. I'm oh, not okay. this week, next Fake week. Out, and we're gonna get. So that could be interesting as well. Yet again, not Another confirmed. Gogeta, just speculation okay. at this point. If only he got his easy. Um, we also have Gogeta Blue here as well. By the looks of it, it doesn't look like we'll we will get it. He's still pretty good. I would have happily taken it. I think did. the biggest issue is is his card draw speed. If they just give him like card draw okay, speed, so as like a, for one more multi and like another unique bit equipment, video. I think it'd be very very good again. Honestly, huge dub so far this video. Who else we have? Super Jito. You know, after his Zenkai is okay, but he's not like a super busted unit. Like general, I can't even remember. And uh, yeah, we got so like units. There is only five and fusion units, unit, which so. is obviously very good. Got animation, but okay, something if you get a feature, like guaranteed feature animation, Maybe. the chance of you getting Gogeta isn't very high. You're more likely to pull one okay, of these other units here. here. Obviously. Freezer, cool. <laughs> but the next big thing is as well, when is this going to go away? Fake out? Uh, 11 days, so... Yeah, just had to be another, Gogeta, another video talking about this as well, but I'm assuming... Way, when you're looking at perspective on things, these the 13th of May for Goku. is when we should see part 3 start. Oh, so we'll, we'll probably uh, yeah, see. Be for today's video. By looks at either Ultra Super Saiyan 2 so Gohan pretty much all or I got so far, Ultra Vegeta Blue. Good from the unit, like the amount of So this is like the big uh, bait so before we get into part three. But uh, yeah, if you guys no, obviously we should get reveals and stuff probably this banner or not. Please let me know down the comments section maybe how next, you guys went in the next week. But uh, yeah, if you guys like this week video, after, more, please give a like and subscribe. Well, and actually, it should be a few days. Maybe the tenth we should actually see the live stream of this, or even the day before. Who knows? But at this point. Would you recommend summoning or skipping? I would say skip for now. Because you could even just save up your Chrono Crystals, wait until like the 10th, and then you still got like two days left on the banner. And then, you know, if they do the reveals and stuff, and it is for GW, if you want to summon or skip for part 3, at least you have the CC still there for GW if you want to summon for them or not. So I think that's probably the best bet to go down. Or, you get in it if you want to summon for the Gammas or Piccolo, Goku Freezer. You still have the option if you save up. But I think we will get more events soon. Like We still have the non-stop raids. There's more CC to get from that. There's more events than that to get CC eventually. Which is good. This anniversary has been very helpful with that. But yeah, at the moment, I'd probably say skip Gogeta Blue's banner. Just for now, maybe wait until like next week. And then if you want to summon, I guess go right ahead. But yeah, at this very point, I would say probably skip. Unless... They start doing hints next week, and it is looking like a, you know, a random ultra, like, a non-hype unit. But, it's anniversary, all these other units have been very hyped, so I think whatever's going for part 3, you're going to want to summon no matter what. And I think that's why they perfectly bring out 
Blue Gogeta has been here, but I wouldn't be too surprised if they bring back another Ultra. And I think the next Ultra they can probably bring back, if we have a quick look here, is most likely Kid Boo. I think he could be the next unit they could bring back, maybe next week for reset. Just to really bait, bait all these players to summon. Yet again, is Kid Boo worth summoning for? Uh, I don't know, it's hard to say. It's very hard to say. He's very good still. But the thing I hate about Ultras is actually their banners. The banners are terrible. They make the banners better. Then go right ahead and do whatever. But at, at this moment, I'd say probably skip Gajir Blue's banner. But uh, yeah, that'll probably do today's video, guys. Uh, let me down in the comment section below if you're going to summon for him or not. Or you're saving up for part 3 of the anniversary or whatever. But uh, yeah, if you guys want to see more, please do like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one.